I guess he just tagged me in. Yes, he did. Praise the Lord, somebody. Praise the Lord, somebody. First of all, I, I, I praise and I thank God for for another opportunity. Turn now. Uh, for another opportunity to minister the gospel for my apostle. Um, everyone who came out, give yourself a hand. The poor pit, I pray that I thank God for my beautiful wife and children. I only got 10 minutes, so bear with me. Surely, God, I thank you and I praise you for today, oh Heavenly Father. God, but right now, God, as the word go forth from each and every one of us, oh Heavenly Father, God, I pray that you begin to shift the atmosphere, God, in this place, God, but more importantly, God, in our hearts and in our minds, God. I pray for a word that change our hearts and not just our minds, oh Heavenly Father, God. I pray, God, that we'll be doers of the word and not just hearers. And we thank you and praise you in advance for we are in expectation of your word. God, in Jesus' name, pray, amen and amen. Amen. It says we, we must worship the Lord in spirit and in truth. As we worship Him in spirit and music, we are now going to worship in truth, which is the word. And if you have your Bible, please turn to 1 Corinthians chapter 9. Oh my God. Right now. Now you can help And just for everyone who don't know, just for everyone who don't know, uh, our, our, our theme this year is grind it out. Grind, grind. Right. And being a former hustler, uh, I know exactly what that consists of. So, again, 1 Corinthians chapter 9, when you have that chapter, say amen so I can give you the verse. Amen. And I have two key verses up here. The, uh, they are not going in order, but they are going to the most important, I think, that's important for us. That's, 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 that's very important for us to have in this season. Verse 23. Goes on to say, we have the words, amen. Amen. And this I do for the gospel's sake. Yeah. And this I do for the gospel's sake, yeah. that I might be partaker thereof with you. Yes. Again, that I might be partaker thereof with you. Now jump up. Whichever way your verse is, you find it. Jump up and down to verse 19. And it goes on to say, For though I be free from all men, yet have I made myself. It says, Yet, like, like in spite of everything else, it says, Yet have I made, uh, I, I, I made myself servant unto all, that I might, just might, uh, because everybody ain't going to be saved. It says, That I might gain the Lord. Uh, you may be seated as we go into the word. Uh, um, if I had a title, the title would be How Low Will You Go? Uh, if you used to dance when you was in the club, don't get too excited. Uh, it says, How Low Will You Go? And, and the first thing I want to uh, point out is the difference between uh, a slave or a servant and a, and a bond slave or a bond servant. Uh, see, uh, see, see, a servant is like this. A master tells the servant, that, see, look, see, I bought you, so you owe me, so you're going to work until everything that I invested in you has paid off. But, 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 see, see that's the slave, huh? But the bond slave says this, or the bond servant says, look, huh? you don't owe me nothing, but because of who you are and what you are doing, I choose to work for you. I choose to do this for you, huh? So we're going to talk about it. Huh? A bond slave or a slave. And today, if you're a bond slave to Christ, can I get an amen? amen. Because we're going to talk about uh, a bond slave, one who is servant or a slave willingly. See, uh, I do ministry willingly. We don't get any grants from the city. Uh, the state don't invest in us. We do this willingly. Each and every one of us come to ministry. Sister Chloe, you dance for us because you do it willingly. Each and every one of us. There's no reason God didn't wake us up and trick us and say, if you do this, then I will do that. But I need everyone to have their mind on the point of that we ought to be bond slaves. We ought to be bond servants. And just to keep it real, sometimes I have to catch myself like, God, why this? Or God, why that? And God has to bring back to my mind, well, do you or are you a bond slave or a bond servant or not? Because if you really want to be real about it, I owe God. God struck for his heart. God died for me. Jesus says, hey, everything that happens, you 
know. And God did it for me. So if you really want to be technical, I ought to be a slave. Or I ought to be a servant unto Christ. But because of his mercy, because of his grace, and because he's not a rapist, he doesn't force ministry on me. He doesn't force the gospel on me. Uh, let's, uh, let's highlight that, highlight it, thank you. It says, for though I be free from all men, I'm free from everybody in here. Uh, don't nobody owe me nothing. I don't have to prove myself to you. But though I be free from all men, it says, yet have I made myself servant up to all. I made myself a servant when I stood at that door to usher. I made myself a servant when I stood back there to press play. Because yet, I made Thank you, praise God, for this word. Amen. 